Temperatures are skyrocketing. Large swaths of the planet are becoming uninhabitable. But what if there was a way to stop it all and cool our planet? The urgency of the climate crisis calls for quite a bit more direct action. We've done such a poor job of geoengineering our climate with our carbon emissions over the last several hundred years that we now need to geoengineer it in a positive direction to offset that. There's something called stratospheric aerosol injection. Professor David Keith says he and others have done the research. Reflecting sunlight to cool the earth from the stratosphere is possible. Think about the fact that one kilogram of sulfur in the stratosphere can reflect as much sunlight as a million kilograms of carbon dioxide trap as heat in the lower atmosphere. These two are on a mission to do just that themselves. Today's a beautiful day to launch some balloons. Andrew and Luke run a company called Make Sunsets, selling what they call a cooling credit. People pay them to inject sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere. The goal is get it up to 66,000 feet. Exactly. Three, two, one. All the way to the stratosphere. That's nearly double the height that commercial airplanes fly. Once in the stratosphere, the balloon pops and the sulfur dioxide is released. All those sulfur dioxide particles mix and spread. Each molecule reflects the sunlight. The CO2 from our past emissions is in the atmosphere, and it's causing real harm to humans today. Solar geoengineering could reduce some of that damage. Luke and Andrew say, we don't have time to waste. Uh, sorry, I'm kind of getting teared up because I'm thinking about my kids. Um, it's just, it's, it's something that, like, I hope more people learn, learn about this, and they do the research. I think people's minds will start shifting. We are in a non-stop carbon party. Global levels of greenhouse gases have gone up every year of our lives. Until that changes, we can't even contemplate anything other than way more radical action than we're doing.